Hey folks, uh, AJ here, uh, making another quick video on some jacuzzi parts. Today we're talking about the uh, air control valve bodies. Uh, within the last year here, jacuzzi changed the style of air control valve bodies that they're offering. Uh, it's causing some problems with some people with some parts. So uh, this video is here to solve all those problems with your uh, internal stems and the valve bodies. Um, so what has happened, folks, is uh, jacuzzi came out with this new style valve body. And if you do not have access to the underside where you can replumb this new valve body in, and uh, all you need to do is just change your internal guts because maybe you broke a stem uh, or you're uh, stripped one way or another and you still have this old style valve body in your tub, uh, I'm going to explain how to take the internal guts out of the new valve body, put it in the uh, old style valve body, get you back up and running. Okay, so first thing we got to do is snap off this retaining ring that is just a little star clip that's holding everything down inside there so get a little screwdriver pop it around a couple times and take that out okay next what you're gonna do is uh, I got myself a little hand nut driver nothing too sharp that's gonna ruin that gasket on the bottom and you're gonna slowly just push that guy out okay now be very very careful we got some o-rings here sometimes they might pop off just put them back in where they need to okay now you need, notice the correlation that is here, okay, with the notch and the holes. This needs to be rotated to fit the new style, uh, to fit in your old style valve body, excuse me. So, Jacuzzi used to just pop this off, but now they're adding a little bit of adhesive glue from the top part and the bottom part of the valve bodies. So I recommend getting two pliers or channel locks or whatnot, and, and get that O-ring out of there. And very, very carefully, now I've already done this before I made this video, but you're going to very, very carefully wiggle the two apart, okay, and get them apart. You can kind of see a little bit of white adhesiveness right there on that top piece there. That's what you need to break off. Now, I'm not going to lie to you folks, it's very, very possible that one of these two components might break when you're taking this apart. Um, if, you, if it does happen, you have to order another one. There's absolutely nothing I can do about it, um, but I will tell you this. The first time I tried it, I got it off without breaking. So uh, hopefully everybody else who watches this video has the same luck that I do. Okay, so anyway, we got that apart. We have the new style, or I'm sorry, the old style valve body. The lineup is very, very important. You got to make sure when you put it together that you leave your openings on left and right. Okay, east and west going in just like that. Okay, basically it's going to line up with the openings underneath. Now you're not going to see that, but that's what you're doing. You're lining up with the openings underneath of the valve body to let the air into the jets. Okay, now when you put this guy back in, there is a little arrow right here at the top. Ooh, let me get you in the camera there. There's a little arrow right there on top. You want to line that up exactly at 12 o'clock when you go to put it back in. Okay, now of course once you go to put that in, you're going to put the star ring in. I'm going to skip that right now that just snaps right back in so if you have everything all lined up perfectly when you go to put your your knob back on okay you're going to notice your knob is pointing to the larger holes okay to the graphic ring so that's letting more air into the tub through the vents in the valve body right there okay as you turn it down you're decreasing the amount of air going through those holes and then all the way to the left, just like your graphic ring shows, is going to have less or no air coming out. Okay, so that's the way. It's very, very important to get all this lined up so that this new air control is going to work for you the way it's properly designed to. Okay, that's all you need to do, folks. I uh, hope this video helps everybody out converting and repairing old valve bodies from uh, the new valve body and parts that are there. Any questions beyond this video, give us a call. We are your Jacuzzi Parts Authority.